2 um, is an evolution of the game franchise, and it's done in, by just us looking at the, uh, the sport itself, you know, us looking at Rally, how exciting it's getting, the different kind of characters that are coming into the sport, Travis Pastrana, Dave Mira, Ken Block, and they're getting involved in events like the X Games, and taking Rally in a new direction with their freshness and their vibrancy and their kind of attitude, so we want the game to reflect on that. Rally Cross was something that people loved from Dirt 1, but they didn't think they, there was enough of it in the game. It wasn't balanced enough. There was only a few tracks. So we've addressed that. We've put more rally cross in. And we've built them around these massive stadiums to kind of, you know, reflect some of that atmosphere that you see at those big events like X Games. The Dirt franchise is all about damaging cars. You know, that was something that we, were, that we spent a lot of effort on for the first game. So the damage is definitely going to be taking a step forward. The polygon count of the vehicles has gone up. And the way that we're going to damage them is going to be more interesting in terms of the way that we're bending uh, physical elements of the car. The game's not meant to be a, a realistic simulation. It's meant to be pick up and play. You know, anyone be, it should be able to get some fun out of this thing. There was some feedback after Dirt One that the, you know, the consumers they loved the way that the game played and they loved the way that you could damage the vehicles. But sometimes they just didn't want to be punished in terms of the way that that was performance damage. You know, the way that it was going to affect your steering and your handling. So the, the, so the way we're going to take it forward is we're going to have a, a, an element of the game, a mode within the game, where uh, it's only really kind of cosmetic damage, it's only visible damage, it doesn't affect the performance of your vehicle. It should be much more fun for those guys to play. Something that consumers fed back on as well from Dirt 1 was that they wanted to be able to customise their vehicles, you know, they wanted to put packs on them and expand them and use them in different ways in different races. So this is something that we're going to allow them to do in Dirt 2. You can buy one car at the beginning of the game, you can take that car into different disciplines. So when you take a Subaru from a straight rally into something like a rally cross, you can flare up the wheel arches, you can put different dips in the hood, you can basically customise the vehicle so that it's more in tune to that type of racing. There's other race uh, elements as well like uh, hill climb, for that one, it's going to be more about tuning up the, you know, beefing up the engine and putting a big uh, spoon on the back of it so you can get more downforce and get it up to that 850 brake horsepower that they use. Third one, we got a lot of feedback from consumers that they didn't like the online mode as much as, uh, you know, as the guys in Europe did because it was all about point-to-point -point rally. And point-to-point uh, -point rally is what the game's been famous for. It's our heritage, so we needed to take care of that for that audience. But the guys in the US, they wanted to do multi-car racing, the rally cross stuff, you know, the raid stuff, and do that online. So that's the step forward that we're making for Dirt 2. We're going to make the whole game online, every track, every discipline, multi-cars, up to eight of you, and especially bringing in those stadium locations. For me, the jumps are awesome, you know. I've been playing a build of the LA Stadium, and there's a massive jump in it. And I just can't resist just turning around and going back and doing it over and over again. Because it's all about hitting, the, hitting it at the right speed. You know, you, you, one mile per hour can mean 20 feet when you go over that jump. So it's really important and it's, you know, it makes it really fun that you actually have to nail it in the right direction and get the right amount of air. Dirt 2 is coming out in September 2009 on 360, PS3, PC, Wii, PSP and DS.